Hey sightseers, today's adventure brings us to a park located in Phillips, Wisconsin. Best known for its folk art, this park has a spooky reputation of being haunted. So come on, what are you waiting for? Let's go check this place out. People have reported strange sensations while exploring the 237 sculptures located here. Why does it feel like I'm being watched by somebody? For some reason, this guy reminds me of Gilligan from Gilligan's Island. What's going on? These guys keep closing in on me. People have reportedly felt cold blasts of air while here in the park. And also some people have said that during the night of a full moon, you can see figures dancing in the park as if there were demons dancing in and around the statues. By the way, if you haven't done so already, be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on any cool adventures. I don't know about you, but this place is giving me the creeps. Scooby-Doo, where are you? I think I see a demon child. All hail the King of Beers! All the sculptures were created by one man, Fred Smith. Fred worked as a lumberjack from his early teens until he retired. After he retired, he suddenly got the urge to create these strange and mythical creatures you see here. Fred created his sculptures out of concrete and glass from beer bottles. Which seems rather fitting considering we are in Wisconsin. That's my evil death stare. After Fred's death in 1976, the Kohler Foundation purchased the park from the Smith family and opened it as a free county park. Regardless if you believe in the supernatural or not, one thing's certain, the statues here are really rather creepy. If you decide to check this place out for yourself, don't let these guys get you in their wagon. You never know where you might end up. Don't forget to subscribe.